about these real quickly? Oh, uh, sure. Uh, anything you can say in front of me, you can say in front of Ro. Ah, uh, you sure? Whoa! Well, I ain't gonna beat around the bush no more, man. What's up? Amber keeps calling my phone, man. Every day, all day long, calling my phone, asking about you. About to tell her where you at. She's already threatened me one time. Talking about some at your own risk. What does that even mean, bro? Um, Dalen, the phrase at one's own risk means, or it is used to indicate that if harm befalls a person or their possessions through their actions, it is their own responsibility. So, with that being said, Dalen, whatever happens to you, it is your fault because you're not telling Amber where her husband is. Now, when a man tells his homeboy, hey, whatever you have to say to me, you say in front of my woman. It's a clear indication that that man has given himself to that woman. He has no secrets. And everybody else or every other woman is in the back. His past is the past. He don't care. He don't want to deal with them. But you know, it's normally a man who's single, not a married man. But what more can we expect from Country Wayne Skits? This man is crazy. And he's gotten daily in the middle of his crap. Come on, Anthony. You got to do better than what you're doing, man. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. For you to take this so light, do you know what you did? The impact? You stood up in my wedding, stopped my wedding, and said that you loved me in front of your wife. Dana was looking like, yeah, that was effed up right there now. Yeah, I ain't going to say that, but my expressions are going to be worth a thousand words. Anthony, that was effed up what you did, and you acting like everything is all good. You can't do that. You need to go home. You need to talk to her. You need to resolve this. Please call the girl. You're right. You're right. That's the least you can do is call her. And make sure she ain't gonna do nothing to me either, please. At your own risk is what she I, said. I, I, I heard you. Dale admit that. <laughs> make sure she ain't gonna do nothing to me either. Now Anthony is regretting saying whatever you have to say, you can say it in front of Ro. He's regretting that now. <laughs> Too late. <laughs> I ain't mean to get you involved. Thank you. Usually you sneakier than this. You could have been. Please don't be honest with you, bro. I did everything I could, man. But when, when a woman threatens you like that, she looked me in my eyes, Anthony. In my eyes and told me that. You know what? I ain't got that. But can you give me something to eat? Just go ahead and order me something, man. I got I can do something depressed. I'm, I'm dealing with trauma from this incident. Can you order me something to eat? I got you. I got you. I'm but these people love to eat. They act like food is going to heal everything. <laughs> I'm depressed. I'm dealing with trauma from this situation. I need to eat. Order me something to eat. And it's the least you can do. Food. I mean, right now, food is the last thing Dayla needs to be worried about. I'm angry. I'll check on you. You're right, bro. You're right. Can somebody tell me why is he color blocked? Like, why they keep showing his ankles and his feet? And, like, does he, does Anthony always dress this way? I don't think I remember him dressing. Like, I mean, I know when he first came on the scene, you know, he was like clean cut. But, you know, now that they've dropped him down a few notches, does he wear color block normally? He looks real silly right now. Real silly. I don't like it. But, Anyway, um, I don't know. Let's get the comment.
God's loving is ultimate. Daylin is so hilarious talking about, I'm depressed dealing with trauma from this incident. I love his character. Yeah, that was kind of funny. Stacy Graham, 15, I see him commenting. Um, Anthony yelling to Daylin to come in ro into Rose's house is next level. Anthony has already moved in in his mind. Mm -hmm. Pammy I Israel 7288 says if Anthony calls Amber, I hope their phones do not link in location. Or well, that's probably going to happen. A Milliner 592 says Anthony is too comfortable hiding out at Rose's home. He has visitors stopping by telling people to come in, ordering food, <laughs> while the girl over there with no answers and no clue and about to be put out. Yeah, Anthony is too un too comfortable, um, A. Milner, 592. Yeah, he's got people coming by, ordering food. They're just chilling, having conversation. JST looking... 9-4 says, Amber is about to have Anthony like that misery movie. Broken ankles with a slate edge. <laughs> guys, guys, remember when I asked y'all about him, the way Anthony was dressed? And why, why were they showing his ankles? And when did he start, you know, wearing color block? Do y'all think they, they're about to turn this into that movie? A replica of the movie Misery? I haven't ever seen it, so I don't know what they're talking about, but they may have a point there. They may have a point there. So let's look at this movie. This, like, it looks like Anthony has um, done a few things. He has... I apparently filed for divorce. So let's look at this next skit. The title says, when Anthony shows Rolanda, he filed for divorce. Okay, I need to see your receipt. Like, when you file for divorce, I need to see a filing receipt. That was not a filing receipt. This was merely just some conversation. Tanya Casey, 3395, she says, ah, Rose. Softly said, I love you too, as Anthony walked away. Damn, I hate Malachi was on the right track. When Amber gets the divorce paper, she's going to go crazy. Can't wait to see the next episode. Okay, what papers did he file? What did I miss? Can somebody please put the link in the comments? I missed something. I don't, I don't see where he filed for divorce. A few moments later. What's going on? Speaking of paperwork... Why don't you take a look at that? Divorce? Are you serious? 